Welcome back. Let's start with the first layer of the Android architecture, which is the Linux kernel, also called Ring Zero, because it's in the heart of the operating system, the inside circle, which could be the most difficult to reach. So it's the most privileged, as you can see in this picture. And what does the Linux kernel handle? It handles basic system services, such as memory management, process management, the network stack, and device drivers, so connecting to the hardware. And for the security part, Linux kernel vulnerabilities are applicable. So regardless which Linux distribution you are running, running on your system, so it could be Ubuntu, it could be Red Hat Linux, or it could be Android, if they all use the same kernel version, then kernel vulnerabilities are applicable. And within Android, but we will come into this in the security section, it uses security enhanced Linux, which can reduce the impact a little bit. Because for example, it handles the sandboxes, that you still have a limited environment within the operating system. But let's have a quick look at ExploitDB, which you are pro probably familiar with. So if you go to ExploitDB and you search for Linux kernel, then you get a list of kernel vulnerabilities, which of course, as a security researcher, it's something you probably use often. So as you can see, there are some famous vulnerabilities, like in 2016, the Dirty Cow vulnerability, which has something to do with copy overwrite. And recently, in 2021 at least, there was also a vulnerability called Dirty Pipe. And it says it the vulnerability was applicable for the kernel version 5.8 until 5.16.11. So what we can do for the enumeration part, if I'm um, access to an Android device, so what I did was ADB shell, and then I want to know what my kernel version is. So I can do uname minus A, and then it will show me Linux localhost kernel version 5.15.41. So in this case, it could be that I'm vulnerable for this dirty pipe vulnerability. So this is something yeah, when you want to test the complete architecture uh, to look into, because this is the explanation of the dirty pipe. And there are some more uh, resources available, so you can dig into uh, the vulnerabilities, of course, which are applicable for your version. And it says dirty pipe is similar to the dirty cow vulnerability indeed, but it's easier to exploit. So of course, that's very uh, useful. Uh, interesting information and it is a vulnerability in the linux kernel which allows overwrite data in arbitrary read-only files which can lead to privilege escalation and can inject code into the root process what we can do we just search for an exploit available for this dirty pipe exploit and then also specifically for android so usually with this kind of exploits what you have to do you have to compile them so you have to have some C compiler, for example, installed, and then you can compile the exploit, which is, for example, C code. You can compile it for your specific Android of a Linux version. So in this case, the specific version for Android, and then copy the exploit to the device, and then just run the exploit and test if it works. 